Miroslav Vanjelovic, an independent filmmaker who for the last decade has been producing films on the human rights of minorities living in Kosovo. His work has been shown all around the world. Miroslav, thank you very much for joining us here on Russia Today. It's a pleasure. Where did the idea for this work come from? The essence of it has been an effort to document uh, cases of severe human rights violation that was affecting and that has been affecting civilian population of Kosovo and Metohija, particularly Serbian and non-Albanian ethnic minority in Kosovo. Uh, to have it recorded as much as it can be recorded and brought to uh, attention of um, whoever wants to see it, lack of media coverage of these uh, crimes and atrocities suffered by civilian population of Kosovo and Metohija is part of the reason why these things could have happened. Why was there such a lack of media coverage then? Because somehow polit politics in a certain way obscured certain issues, such as uh, these atrocities suffered by the Serbian civilian population, because simply it, considered, it was considered maybe politically incorrect to talk about suffering that Serbian and non-Albanian civilian population has experienced. Politically incorrect by who? The Serbian authorities? Well, I guess not by the Serbian authorities, but by the world media, uh, if I can say. But the thing is, I'm more concerned, much more, the lack of uh, interest shown by the Serbian media. It's not about history. It is not about identity. It is not about religion. It's about loyalty to a fellow human being. By betraying them, and betrayal is if you don't talk about someone who's dying or who's been killed and who's yours, we are actually losing a ground to become civilized society here in Serbia. We must ask about them. They must be the number one thing in the mind of our politicians. Because if they are not, then what else is? And that's why I think we maybe failed so far as a country to convince the world what is it really that we are fighting for? Because we have not stood together for these people. Is this issue only about Kosovo? Or is it an international issue? International community arrived in Kosovo to stop killings and to create and to help create multi-ethnic society that's civilized. That's the measure that we will measure success of this international mission. Implementation of all these money, weaponry and political will. Is it going to result with better life for an ordinary citizen of Kosovo? Is it easier to present your ideas here? I mean, in my efforts to show my movies to the largest possible audience that took me all over the world, uh, I basically, the lucky break happened in the States first. Uh, some time 2001, I was allowed to show and invited to show some of this footage in Columbia University, Harriman Institute, later to other universities, I mean, respect respectable institutions. So I ended up showing it in every kind of important instance in the States, at the universities, at the Congress, at the Senate, at the National Press Center. In all these years, which 
I mean, it was easier for me to show movies in the States than to show them in Serbia. Because here at least, and that's maybe something from my point of view, uh, here, even though politically it wasn't acceptable, if it's presented in a certain way, because my movies didn't go into politics, just simply showing what's happening in a certain locations and what time. If it's presented in a certain way, no matter what it is, it'll, it'll be allowed to be seen if it's done in any kind of uh, acceptable manner, techn technologically speaking, or I don't know what. It, it, um, so it was easier to show the failure of the international community in Kosovo in the States or in some countries in Western Europe than as it was the case in Serbia. Because in Serbia, it, it, it went on and on. Whoever was in the power in Serbia had to, you know, ignore human rights violation in Kosovo. Why? Because when the nationalist government of Mr. Kostonica, with his close connection with Russia, was in power for eight years after Milosevic, the territorial integrity uh, is be is, uh, was seen as something more important than the human rights, mm -hmm. these values. Because if you talk about human rights, it means like you're not talking about territorial integrity, and for them, territorial integrity of Serbia, that means protecting Kosovo to be the part of Serbia, ignoring the 2 